We didn't start the fire. Don't believe this burning Pentecostals returning. We didn't start the fire, but it will go on. Someone tell me I'm wrong. Elsa, wake up. Hey Anna, how did you sleep last night? Terrible again, how about you? Worth, do you think it could have anything to do with the people of the real fan club? They're probably just trying to find a new barista. I'm not completely convinced. No time for diddle dad, I'll see you in the newsroom at 10. Bye. Okay, bye. Where do you think we should publish the new research on future? Prosperity and comfort. Front page, of course. Wow. Don't we normally reserve that for human interest stories? What could be more interesting than a boomy economy? I guess you're right. <coughs> it's honourable evil. We better take it. Hi, princesses. Hi, honourable evil. Just checking in on how you're going with the afternoon edition. Well, yes. All set for the front page. Excellent work. Have you spoken to your sub editors yet? Not yet. For the last time, it's spelled. E-V-E-L, not I-L. Making my empathy department's role a lot harder with these mistakes. Honourable Evil, I have a question about the castle. Are you sure we have nothing to worry about? Business as usual. Well, I've been hearing a few things. What kind of things? And from who? The people. Don't listen to the people. They only know what we tell them. Nothing more, nothing less. We'll take it from here. Sometimes I think you're a little too close to honourable evil, do you know what I'm saying? He's our brother. Miss Michaels, I'm so glad I got someone of your potential applying for the role. Well, your ad had certain charm about it. How so? A lot of zeros to start. You're motivated by money? Motivated? I would sell my song to the devil and find a new way to send the invoice. Nice coal collection, do you mind? Help yourself. That's clean coal, it's the future. Uh, must have forgotten to laugh in that one. Certainly appears so. Let's get into it. I'm particularly interested in your more difficult clients. The first big break was Exxon Valdez. I mean, they took a bath, but could have been worse. Then there was Big Tobacco. Similar story. Baby formula in China. Uh, Volkswagen. Cricket Australia. Anything weather related? Not really, but I'm a fast learner. <laughs> Sounds like we're gonna get some rain. Did you see the weather? Don't believe in them. Wind, rain, sun. The big man's the only one who decides what happens in my city. You mean like God? Hallelujah. You got the job. You start this afternoon. I have a big press conference. Awesome. Red Suns, bushfires, eternal drought. I've checked the official website and they all say the same thing. There's nothing to see here. I still take on the protesters then. We call it the people. Our people. And they look a little bit angry to you. <laughs> They'll be fine once they read the afternoon editions of the Royal Times. Did Harper just use sign language? You learned to pass. Watching too many press conferences from that firefighting alarmist, I guess. 
I'm bored doing nothing. I'm going out to change the world. Evo, 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 Evo. Get any tough questions? Just deny everything. If you can, blame it on someone else. My many, many fans. Today, I come a truly good news story. I know some of you have been concerned with the weather of late. Yay! But I have good news. The economy is booming and I have removed term limits. So there really is nothing to worry about. Yay! Any questions? Do you deny climate change is real? Yes. Do you still deny the moon lady? Thank you. What about the drought? You sure have a lot of science, little girly. Shouldn't you be in school or something? Let down. Me your evil little friends did that. Do you deny that there's a fire in Killer Belly? If that were the case, I'd know about it. It's on the news right now. Well, the ABC, that's it. Their budget's going negative next year. It's out now, it rained. That was me, I made it rain. Check social media if you don't believe me. <gasps> right, enough questions now, that's a wrap up. If you need more information, check the afternoon edition of the Royal Times, that's all. See, that went pretty well. Your thoughts? That was a disaster. I need a new strategy from you by morning or you're finished. Eureka, I've got it. Finally, I'll be able to get some sleep. What was that? Hello? Who the heck are you? Well, I'm the ghost of Climate Pass. You look more like a great to me. Well, that's a completely different movie. Then what are you doing here? Well, I'm here to change your future forever. Back in early 2019, Australia was a truly magical place. No fires. There were koalas. There were some. There were snakes. There was ladybugs. Now, there are none. What's that got to do with me? And if Honourable Evil implements your strategy, in three years, there'll be no puppies, no bunnies, no unicorns, no rainbows. No one's taking my rainbows and unicorns. The good thing about modern society is we have scientists who study this kind of thing. Rather than the bigots Jim and John down the pub, all they do is vote. What can I do? All you have to do is ask yourself one simple question. Do you believe in science? Science, Oh my god, this is going to change my future forever. Elsa, Anna, there's something I need to tell you. It's about the climate. It is an emergency. We call it weather and I don't take meetings with traitors. That was a long, long time ago. Besides, I have a secret report. Secret report? I guess you better come in then. If everything in this report is true, then we have a problem. But I'm not sure what we can do about it. We could print an article on the front page of the Royal Times. That won't work. You'll just call it fake news. But I do have a better idea. The afternoon edition of the Royal Times a new tailor has moved to town. <coughs> it seems that he makes pants that deflect negative press inquiries. Miss Michaels, you're fired. Ladies and gentlemen, once again I come bearing great news. But before that, I want to give a little shout out to a great man who recently whipped me up with a snazzy new pair of pants. Take a look. He's not wearing any pants! <laughs> oh my god. My career is over.
Maybe we should stop believing everything we read in the paper. Sure dodged a bullet there. All oh, thanks to Miss Michael. Do you think the people are for picking us? I'll make sure of it. Whatever happened to Honorable Evil? He got life in heaven. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. You can run, but you can't hide from science. 